ಮೇದಿನಿ ವಿಶ್ವ ವಿನೋದಿನಿ ನಂದಿನುತೆ ಶ್ರೀವರವಿಂದ್ಯ ಶಿರೋದಿನಿ ವಾಸಿನಿ ವಿಷ್ಣು ವಿಲಾಸಿನಿ ಜೇಷ್ಣು Depression is probably not caused by a chemical imbalance in the brain. New study. This is from 2022. Someone in my audience only pointed this out. So I looked it up. Thanks whoever pointed this out. I forgot your name. But remember that dialogue in Munna Bhai MBBS, Chemical Locha? That's when Bollywood started making people aware of the mental health problems we might face in our lives. So this study proves that there is no such thing as mental locha. If you feel sad, if you feel lazy, that's your problem. Work out, do a, do 5 push-ups, wake up in the morning, go in the sun, go for a walk. And if you don't feel like doing that, remember that no one most people don't feel like doing that. We are not kids that will like to go out and play. Virat Kohli does not uh, feel like going out and working out and giving his 100% every day. MS Dhoni does not feel that. He does because it's his duty because that's how he earns his money and that's what he is put on the earth to do. that's that's what he's supposed to do that's what he has to do it's his profession it's not a matter of feeling like doing it okay workout is not about feeling like doing it the only solution to whatever we call depression today is in my opinion good diet and workout because your brain is a muscle which is inside your body which just like any other part of your body functions on good diet good blood circulation good hydration there's no other aspect to this but this study proves my claim right let's discuss this paper now writing in the conversation professor joanna moncrief and dr mark horowitz both ucl psychiatry and this is a mainstream uh, research paper it was study uh, it was published on the university college london website so i'm not not bringing out uh, alex jones kind of websites to prove my point okay report on the new research showing with uh, showing that no clear evidence that serotonin levels or serotonin activity are responsible for depression and they say that जिन लोगों का बाई डिफॉल्ट ऐसे ही सेरेटोनिन कम हो गया है ऐसे ही मैजिकली उनको हम थोड़ा बहुत सेरेटोनिन uh, uh, दवाई दे देंगे उसके बाद ठीक हो जाएगा बट बट द द फन पार्ट इज दैट सेरेटोनिन इज एक्चुअली गॉट डैम क्रिएटेड बाय वर्कआउट सो इफ एट ऑल देयर इज समथिंग रियली कॉल्ड डिप्रेशन इफ एट ऑल दैट इज क्रिएटेड बाय सेरेटोनिन डेफिशिएंसी दैट मींस दैट वर्कआउट इज इवन मोर इंपॉर्टेंट इंसटेड ऑफ सम पिल्स बिकॉज़ वर्कआउट एग्जैक्टली क्रिएट्स सेरेटोनिन इन योर बॉडी इमीडिएटली दैट्स द मोस्ट हिलेरियस पार्ट वर्कआउट स्पोर्ट्स एब्सोल्युटली गुड पेरेंटिंग एंड मॉरल वैल्यूज and like i was saying in my uh, other uh, video about mental health as well that aaj ke aaj ke date mein uh, if a parent does not send their uh, kids to go play an organized sport there it's uh, as it's absolutely child abuse because पिछले जनरेशन में क्या था कि बच्चे वैसे भी स्कूल के बाद थोड़ा बहुत खेलकूद करते थे आज नहीं करते हैं तो आज अगर खेलकूद किसी को करवाना है किसी का बॉडी अगर एक्टिव रखना है तो आपको ऑर्गेनाइज स्पोर्ट्स में डालना ही पड़ेगा अंकित शेट्टी सिंह मे बी वी शुड मेक द गीगा चैट ट्रेंड कूल टू काउंटर डिप्रेशन दैट इज वट एंड्रू टेट हैज डन बेसिकली हैज एंड बिकॉज सी यू कैन हैव डिजग्रीमेंट्स विद एंड्रू टेट आई हैव अबाउट ट्वेंटी थर्टी परसेंट डिजग्रीमेंट्स विद एंड्रू टेट बट वी हैव अप्रिशिएट हिम फॉर वट ही इज डूइंग राइट इज एंड वी हैव टू फाइंड अलायस एवरीवेयर थिंक ऑफ योर सेल्फ लाइक द इंडियन फॉरन पॉलिसी वी विल हैव फ्रेंडशिप विद यू एस ए वेर इट बेनिफिट्स अस वी विल हैव फ्रेंडशिप विद रशिया वेर इट बेनिफिट्स अस वी डोंट हैव टू कंप्लीटली हैव सेक्स विद रशिया not do we have to completely go kissing usa okay it's not the era we live in see what donald trump and andrew tate are doing for countering the wokeism cause they are fucking wrecking balls they are they are a stone which is being thrown in a hornet's nest and they are creating an absolute ruckus they are destroying so many talking points and myths so you should appreciate them for this and not hate them for the other things you might disagree with them on but we have only one such wrecking ball in india and that is j sai deepak and even he does not speak on these things right because he has to focus he's a full time lawyer and he's writing books and he's going around giving talks and speeches to aur kitne topics mein uh, uh, cover karega so someone has to say these things and hopefully we will uh, make people aware of this for three decades people have been deluged with information suggesting that depression is caused by a quote unquote chemical imbalance that famous chemical locha pushed by bollywood chemical imbalance in the brain namely an imbalance of a brain chemical called serotonin however our latest research research review shows that the evidence does not support it although first proposed in the 1960s the serotonin theory of depression started to be widely promoted by the pharmaceutical industry in the 1990s in association with its efforts to market a new range of antidepressants <laughs> 1985 88 mein all all the main uh, mental health drugs got approved by fda okay और उसके बाद से ही ये सब स्टडीज मेन स्ट्रीम हो गया उसके बाद से ही मेंटल हेल्थ अवेयरनेस मेन स्ट्रीम हो गया और उसके बाद से ही स्कूल शूटिंग्स बढ़ गए कोरिलेशन इज नॉट ऑलवेज कॉजलिटी बट व्हाट इफ इट इज इन दिस केस बिकॉज वी कॉन्ट सी एनी अदर चेंज दैट हैपन इन द इन द अमेरिकन माइंड राइट द सेरेटोनिन थियोरी ऑफ डिप्रेशन स्टार्टेड टू बी वाइडली प्रोमोटेड बाई द फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री इन दाइनटीज इन एसोसिएशन विद इट्स एफर्ट्स टू मार्केट अ न्यू रेंज ऑफ एंटीडिप्रेशन नोन एज एस एस आर आईज सिलेक्टिव सेरेटोनिन 
reuptake inhibitors. The idea was also endorsed by official institutions such as the American Psychiatric Association, which still tells the public that, quote, differences in certain chemicals in the brain may contribute to symptoms of depression. May. May hai yaha pe, jo log bol rahe hai, depression is real, wo bhi bol rahe hai, shayad. Magar, pills jab dena hai, wo shayad nahi hai, tab definitely pills dena hai. तब कोई डाइट चेंज रिकमेंड नहीं करना है कोई स्पोर्ट फिजिकल एक्टिविटी नहीं रिकमेंड करना है काउंटलेस डॉक्टर्स हैव रिपीटेड द मैसेज ऑल ओवर द वर्ल्ड इन देयर प्राइवेट सर्जरीज एंड इन द मीडिया पीपल हैव एक्सेप्टेड दैट दे वर व्हाट दे वर टोल्ड एंड मेनी स्टार्टेड टेकिंग एंटी डिप्रेशंस बिकॉज़ दे बिलीव्ड दैट दे हैड समथिंग रॉन्ग विद देयर ब्रेन दैट रिक्वायर्ड एन एंटी डिप्रेशन टू पुट राइट नॉट वर्क आउट इन द पीरियड ऑफ दिस मार्केटिंग पुश एंटी डिप्रेशंट यूज क्लाइंबड ड्रामेटिकली and they are now prescribed to one in six of the adult population in england for example for a long time certain academics including some leading psychiatrists have suggested that there is no satisfactory evidence to support the idea that depression is a result of abnormally low or inactive inactive serotonin others continue to endorse the theory until now however there has been no comprehensive review of the research on serotonin and depression that could enable firm conclusions either way at first sight The fact that SSRI type antidepressants act on the serotonin system appears to support the serotonin theory of depression. SSRIs temporarily increase the availability of serotonin in the brain which could have been done by five push-ups anyway, but this does not necessarily imply that depression is caused by the opposite of this effect. Interesting. There are other explanations for antidepressants' effects. In fact, drug trials show that antidepressants are barely distinguishable from a placebo. Placebo aap logo ko pata hai kya hai? A fake pill. which does not have any medication which is given to you just to check out whether you uh, get healthy because of an actual medication or do you feel you just got better because you think you consumed a great medication even though that medication is actually a blank pill that's called placebo and that is how these studies are done so dekho placebo se kin kitne logo ka depression theek kar diya jo ki jo ki fake tha which was not a, not even a real medicine there are other explanations for antidepressant effects in fact drug trials show that antidepressants are barely distinguishable from a placebo or a dummy pill when it comes to treating depression look at this fucking thing also antidepressants appear to have a generalized emotion numbing effect which may influence people's moods although we do not know how this effect is produced or much about it we don't know much about it 2023 mein bhi ye log ye bol rahe hain but emotion numbing effect which is also given to uh, treat adhd kisi ka mood swings thoda bahut ho raha hai usko ye bolne ke wajah ke are itna mood swings mat karo don't over react ye bolne ke wajah ye lo thoda bhai adhd ka medication thoda 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 try karke dekho sun ke dekho how how you how uh, you you first start consuming drugs or alcohol that's how uh, therapists behave there has been extensive research on the serotonin system since the 1990s but it has not been collected systematically before We conducted an uh, umbrella review that involved systematically identifying and collating existing overviews of the evidence from each of the main areas of research into serotonin and depression. Although there have been systematic uh, reviews of individual areas in the past, none have combined the evidence from all the different areas taking this approach. One area of research we conclude uh, we included was research comparing levels of serotonin and its breakdown products in the breakdown products in the blood or brain fluid. Overall this research did not show a difference between people with depression and those without depression. Another area of research has focused on serotonin receptors which are proteins on the ends of the nerves that serotonin links up with and which can transmit or inhibit serotonin's effects. Research on the most commonly investigated serotonin receptor suggested either no difference between people with depression and people without depression or that serotonin activity was actually increased in people with depression. The opposite of the serotonin theory's prediction. What the fuck? Research on the serotonin quote unquote transporter that is the protein which helps to terminate the effect of serotonin. This is the protein that SSRI is act on. Also suggests suggested that if anything there was increased serotonin activity in people with depression. Look at this. There is increased serotonin activity in people with depression. However, these findings may be explained by the fact that many participants in these studies had used or were currently using antidepressants lol. We also looked at research that explored whether depression can be included in uh, uh, can be induced in volunteers by artificially lowering levels of serotonin. Two systematic reviews from 2006 and 2007 and a sample of the 10 most recent studies at the time the current research was conducted found that lowering serotonin did not produce depression in hundreds of healthy volunteers in hundreds of healthy volunteers healthy volunteers 
जिसका ब्रेन हेल्थ ठीक है फिजिकल हेल्थ ठीक है इसलिए ब्रेन हेल्थ ठीक है सी वन ऑफ द रिव्यूज शोड वेरी वीक एविडेंस ऑफ एन इफेक्ट इन अ स्मॉल सब ग्रुप ऑफ पीपल विद फैमिली हिस्ट्री ऑफ डिप्रेशन बट दिस ओनली इन्वॉल्व सेवेंटी फाइव पार्टिसिपेंट वेरी लार्ज स्टडीज इन्वॉल्विंग टेन्स ऑफ थाउजेंड ऑफ पेशेंट लुक एट जीन वेरिएशन इंक्लूडिंग द जीन दैट हैज द इंस्ट्रक्शन फॉर मेकिंग द सेरेटोनिन ट्रांसपोर्टर दे फाउंड नो डिफरेंस इन द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ वेराइटीज ऑफ दिस जीन बिटवीन पीपल विद डिप्रेशन एंड हेल्थी कंट्रोल्स Although a famously uh, famous early study found a relationship between the serotonin transporter transporter gene and stressful life events larger more compre- comprehensive studies suggest no such relationships exist stressful life events in themselves however exerted a strong effect on people's subsequent risk of developing depression yeah magar wo depression hai koi diagnosis hai ki wo sirf sadness hai and can that not be mitigated by workouts and good good diet some of the studies in our overview that included people who were taking or had previously taken antidepressants showed evidence that antidepressants may actually lower the concentration or activity of serotonin the serotonin theory of depression has been one of the most influential and extensively researched biological theories of the origins of depression our study shows that this view is not supported by scientific evidence it also calls into question the basis for the use of antidepressants Most antidepressants now in use are presumed to act via their effects on serotonin. Some also affect uh, some also affect the brain chemical uh, noradrenaline, but experts agree that the evidence for the involvement of noradrenaline in depression is weaker than that for serotonin. There is no other accepted pharm- uh, pharmacological mechanism for how antidepressants might affect depression. Uh, if antidepressants exert their effects as placebos or by numbing emotions, then it is not clear that they do more good than harm this is my main point my my second biggest point is that everything can be solved with workout and good diet but even bigger th- than that this is my point check out this paragraph once more if antidepressants if antidepressants exert their effects as even placebos agar placebo se bhi antidepressant ka kaam ho raha hai or the real antidepressants are working simply as uh, emotion numbing mechanisms okay इमोशंस उतना फील ही मत करो ठीक है दे आर ब्लंटिंग आउट योर इमोशंस देन इट इज नॉट क्लियर वेदर दे डू मोर डैमेज और दे डू मोर गुड्स में भी कॉन्सेंसस नहीं है कैन यू बिलीव दिस ये सब इग्नोर करके पूरा दिन मेंटल हेल्थ अवेयरनेस मरवा रहे हैं लेट मी चेक सम कमेंट्स वंस मेडिटेशन कैन हैव इफेक्ट ऑन सेरोटोनिन सी देयर आर्गुमेंट इज दैट सेरोटोनिन इज नॉट इवन अ फैक्टर हियर एज फॉर मेडिटेशन मेडिटेशन के लिए एक थोड़ा फैमिली का कल्चर का अपब्रिंगिंग का थोड़ा बहुत फैक्टर है आई थिंक इन इन टुडेज era because attention span has changed drastically isn't it uh, hum logo ka attention span at least uh, hum to 90s wale kids hai jo log 2000 and uske baad janme hai unka attention span to gaya hai kachre mein to unko aap meditation kaise karwayenge i think that's basically impossible and that should be given up and instead send them off to sports so that their pent up energy is burnt off until previous generation meditation could have been solution and even today it can be a solution if they see their parents meditating frequently or regularly in a in a, in a disciplined way नहीं तो अकेले माँ बाप पूरे दिन बैठ के काम करेंगे और आईपीएल देखेंगे और बच्चे को बोलेंगे भाई थोड़ा मेडिटेशन कर ले उससे नहीं होगा ऑल दो व्यूइंग डिप्रेशन एज अ बायोलॉजिकल डिजॉर्डर मे सीम लाइक इट वुड रिड्यूस स्टिग्मा जिसका जिसका चक्कर लिबरल पूरा दिन चला रहे हैं कि डिस्टिग्माटाइज करते हैं मेंटल हेल्थ को मेंटल हेल्थ इज जस्ट लाइक योर फिजिकल हेल्थ इवन दो मेंटल हेल्थ हैपन इन साइड द ब्रेन विच इज पार्ट ऑफ योर फिजिकल हेल्थ ओनली तो इनफैक्ट रिसर्च हैज शोन द ऑपोजिट Although viewing depression as a biological disorder may seem like it would reduce stigma, in fact, research has shown the opposite, and also that people who believe their own depression is due to a chemical imbalance are more pessimistic about their chances of recovery. Can you believe that? Believe this? I did not read the full paper. Okay, I had read only half of it, and then decided that I'll, I'll read the entire thing in the in the live stream. So this is extremely a uh, fun, a uh, fascinating discovery for me as well. This is everything I, I have been arguing basically. Can you believe this sentence? This is exactly what I have seen in all all the, those fake depression kids, or even all my friends who suffer from this. They are my friends, but they are wrong on this. And not all my friends who have suffered from depression hardcore have never played a sport. Only one friend I have, which who has played a sport when she was young, then she got into depression because she left the sport. She was extremely obese and was taking uh, thousand kinds of mental health pills. Was talking about mental mental health stigma all the time. And now I convinced her to get into Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Now she has a absolutely jacked and ripped body. She can. basically kill any um, untrained man she meets on the road and her depression is also gone but anyway shows that people who believe their own depression is due to a chemical imbalance are more pessimistic about their chances of recovery inko lagta hai ke hamara to bhai brain aisa hi hai ab hum ka kare workout karke ka kare 
का होगा सब क्या रिकवरी नहीं होगा हमारा that is that is the conclusion they reach it is important that people know that the idea that depression results from a so called chemical imbalance is hypothetical and we do not understand what temporarily uh, elevating serotonin or other biochemical changes produced by antidepressants do to the brain and especially because it's artificially done we conclude that it is impossible to say that taking ssri antidepressants is worthwhile or even completely say, safe people need all this information to make informed decisions about whether or not to take antidepressants insane jaya jaya he mahishasura mardini ramya ka pardini shaila 